when you're lying on your deathbed, watching your toes curl up, you're thinking, what have I done with my life? You don't want to be wondering about all the things you could have done or should have done. My principle is to live life to the full. No regrets. What's on your list? 12 Global Challenge yachts are embarking on what's known as the most gruelling leg of the race. This leg could take up to six weeks and throughout that time the crews will have to endure and they're on. Six Delmar, waves. First but some of the these boats are fighting to get back into the race after serious medical problems. With the infamous Cape Horn to round and the Southern Ocean to tackle, it's easy to see why this is called the world's toughest yacht race. So when you press the action replay button on your life, will it be full of the usual stuff? or packed with wonderful experiences and adventures. That leg, the first leg only, was due to be over 6,000 miles and would take over a month. And we had man overboard within about six hours of the start. We still had another 10 months to go. This is me hugging Karen. She's not in any pain. And we leave her with the Chilean Navy. So she's not that unhappy, actually. As a team, we had a winning attitude, as I'm sure you all do, and that was to come first. Our vision was to be on the top step of the podium, receiving that winner's trophy from Sir Chave Live. We wanted to beat the competition, we wanted to beat those other boats. So of course that was all about being fast. And everything we did was, will it make the boat go faster? I have done 89 things on my list of things to do before I die. And they include sailing around the world, paddling down the Mekong, bog snorkelling and tomato throwing, running the marathon and kayaking the length of the Thames. I'm now training to swim the channel. What's on your list? It was inspiring, she held the audience. I've bought the book because I just want to find out more. It was just a lovely, lovely inspirational talk. We do only live once and you've got to go for it and that's a great message, but we forget it in everyday life, so fantastic.